Vacacionar en Los Cabos sin disfrutar de los mares que los rodean es simplemente impensable. Los más de 70 kilómetros de playas que bordean a Los Cabos, además de sus suaves y doradas arenas, ofrecen una gran variedad de atractivos y actividades acuáticas, pero en especial las playas que se ubican alrededor de Cabo San Lucas. Desde los paseos en kayak para ejercitarse disfrutando del sol y el mar, hasta la posibilidad de contemplar la bahía desde las alturas, pasando por la visita al arco y sus globos marinos, las lanchas con fondo de cristal, las motos acuáticas y mucho más. espectáculo que no se puede perder es el que Los Cabos le ofrece bajo el mar. Si bien el buceo es una de las mejores formas para admirar las bellezas naturales del mundo submarino, que requiere de cierta experiencia o al menos del tiempo necesario para tomar las lecciones y así poder bajar a las profundidades. Sin embargo, no todos tienen la posibilidad de hacerlo y por eso, en Los Cabos ahora se han creado nuevas formas para que cualquier persona pueda experimentar alguno de los sueños de Julio Verne, como aquel, el de las 20.000 leguas de viaje submarino caminando sobre el fondo del mar. Bueno, estamos con Mike Stafford, quien es uno de los creadores de diversos aparatos que pueden ser utilizados para explorar el mar. Uh, I'm, I'm sure that you've been inspired by Julio Verne and other like Jacques Cousteau. Tell us a little bit about why you've been involved in this kind of uh, activities. Well, uh, ever since I was a little a child, I used to go to Disneyland and ride on the underwater submarines, very similar to these. And uh, Jules Verne, of course, was a hero, and the whole story of the, the under, uh, Nautilus undersea adventure was fascinating. And as I grew older, I had the opportunity with my brother, I have a twin brother, and we uh, looked at the, uh, uh, the business in general and submarines, and we decided to build a submarine that would allow everyone to, to go underwater and enjoy the underwater world. And how, how uh, all these adventures started? Uh, you uh, became a, 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 a student of the, of the devices under the water? I was a commercial diver, and I spent many years diving commercially underwater. Uh, I have a background in construction and electronics, and my brother was a visionary and uh, we took uh, our experiences and hired the right people um, and just we just started developing this particular type of boat this boat and what else uh... Uh, many different types full submersibles a flying submarine that's called the aviator it's the only one in the world i know the aviator it yes. was here Yeah, yeah, combo, yeah, 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 I, I, I got it. I, yeah. In fact, we can see the Avator right now here in the... Yeah, we built that in our, we built that in, in our facility in the Mather Air Force Base in California. So we have uh, Sea Trek, which is another uh, one of our... Sea Trek is with this helmet. helmeted diving system. Another copy somewhat of Jules Verne mm -hmm. in the 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea. And, and this helmet uh, allows to jump people, uh, people who never had that experience, this experience of uh, being in the water. So it's been uh, very successful. Absolutely, that's what it's about. It's getting people underwater in a very s simple, non-threatening, non-physical way. It's it's entertainment. Very safe. No? Very safe. We've we've had no incidents that involve our equipment at all. And snuba, snuba too. Is snuba? What is this snuba? Snuba is an uh, it's a flotation device that takes the air and transmits it through a tube to the diver below, and the divers are if it's a fully guided tour and we have snuba and sea drag all over the world as well as our nautilus boats and also there are another like uh, motorcycles on the water also you, you bob you have uh no we did that's a that's called bob and it is not our product but it's an interesting product also i like bob um but it's not our product so i'm sure that you, you we can compare your uh your uh your work with uh, jack Cousteau because jack Cousteau invented the, the skewer Oh, I, I think he's a little bigger in the world than we are, but I do know his son and uh, Michelle. No? Michelle, see, and um, 
I, I think that we are, we're more of an entertainment company. Entertainment. You're the uh, uh, Jacques Cousteau for the inter entertainment. Jacques, exactly. Jacques Cousteau is more of a educational, scientific, scientific and we're, we want to introduce more people to the ocean, and therefore then they may become followers of Jacques Cousteau and the society, but our goal really is entertainment, recreation. Jacques Cousteau, considerado el padre del buceo, inventó el famoso aqualón o 